Hey guys, what's going on? So I've been doing some research on the NFL expansion project. It looks like they want to hit 40 teams total by the year 2040. I think this definitely could be possible. You could get five teams per each division. The NFL also wants to extend the regular season to 18 games. So that would be about eight uh, divisional games and then 10 being the rest of the regular season. And then I think if they just added like one or two teams um, over a certain increment of time, they could just do a single division with five teams and go from there. They've already done that with the AFC East before, so the logistics of that could all be worked out. Just briefly going over the location for some of these teams, my personal take is that these teams should stay within the United States. So I'll just kind of give my own proposal for eight teams. And my framework for going into this, I think kind of just what I kept in mind when coming up with these teams and their concepts would be A, is this a unique team name? You don't want to do something over and over again, whether it's like a new bird specifically. There's so many birds already, I think. You should stray away from that. I think the more original, the better. You don't want too much overlap from college. There are already a good amount of teams that do overlap uh, in terms of their team name or mascot with the NFL. So it's not a huge issue. And then would the team name be unique to the specific location? I think this is really critical. You don't kind of want to just throw a random team name on a city. It doesn't really build as much of a community and isn't really as special uh, for the location. So I think that's a really key factor to consider here. And then is this a suitable location? Really got to look at the population, the amount of football there, stuff like that. And then even some more detailed stuff, kind of some more urban planning. This is probably a topic for another video. Finding specific places to develop these stadiums is really crucial because you don't want to tear down something that's already built there. Reuse is a really good policy. Also don't want to be building something that could really disrupt the community or neighborhood or whatever exact zone it would be in. So that is really another topic uh, for discussion. So first off, the eight cities I thought would be really neat to have uh, a football team would be number one. Portland, Oregon. Oregon doesn't have a team. Portland is a pretty big city. Albuquerque, New Mexico, another state without a football team. And then Oklahoma also doesn't have a team. Nebraska doesn't have a team. I think Omaha is a good choice. Idaho also doesn't have one. I think Boise would be great. Salt Lake City, Utah. And then I think also kind of talking about reuse, both St. Louis and San Diego, California are great choices as well because you know there's already been somewhat of a reputable team there with both the Rams and the Chargers in the past. So I think these are the eight locations I'm gonna go with and then we'll get into the team names. Uh, for Portland, Oregon, was reading a little bit about the area. Seems like there's a lot of pumpkin patches there, uh, a lot of different pumpkin festivals and stuff like that around October. Also a lot of coffee shops with pumpkin spice. So I think something with the pumpkin theme would be pretty neat. Also could be really cool seasonally. You have the season from September to the new year. So around October, especially Halloween, I think this could be really cool. Originally was thinking uh, the Portland pumpkins. Wasn't too sure on this, but I think an alternative to this, the Portland patches, being short for pumpkin patches, I think that could be a cool name as well. Then we'll go to Albuquerque, New Mexico. I was reading a little bit about the specific animals and reptiles and stuff like that that are unique to the area. Something that caught my eye was the coral snake. I think just looking at the stripes, I could really see a cool color scheme for that. And then also looking into the history a little bit, Albuquerque's city flag uh, focuses on the colors red and yellow. The state of New Mexico is the inverse of this, yellow and red. So I think you would have both of those colors included in here, which would be really cool. And then San Diego, California was thinking something with the beach. Really like the idea of a team called the Surfers. I think that would be really neat, really fitting to the area. And then Boise, Idaho was looking at some of the animals. Originally was thinking beavers, but Oregon State already has it. So I like the Bobcats a little bit more. 
I think that would be neat for Boise. Salt Lake City, I wanted to do something kind of with the land. Uh, one landmark I was looking at is the Bonville South Flats. So I think just the flats would be a cool name and kind of could really be cool with, you know, a lot of the snow in Utah. Omaha, Nebraska was reading about uh, Omaha being the home of the first transcontinental railroad. So I think something with trains would be really fitting. Was originally thinking the locomotives, but I think it's a little bit too long. So I think a shortened version of that, just the motives. And then for uh, St. Louis, also another popular uh, landmark there, the Gateway Arch, I think is a really popular topic uh, when you're looking at a team and just the area in general. There's already a community college there that I think is named the Archers. So I think it would be better to stray away from that. When you look at the name, the Gateway Arch, and then it being in reference to uh, the Gateway to the West, I think the Gateways would be a pretty cool name, and then you could still do stuff with the logo of the landmark. Oklahoma City, again, doing some research on kind of the animals and stuff like that that are native to the area. I know I mentioned not doing birds, but I think owls is a little bit different from that. Was looking at some of the specific types of owls, but just all seemed a little bit too long for a name. So I think sometimes a little bit simpler is better. So I think the Oklahoma City Owls has a little bit of a ring to it. And you could use some of the specific owls to the area for design, such as with the logo and the uniform. So I think that would be a really cool way to include that. So these are just eight ideas that I had uh, for new NFL team names uh, within the United States. So this is kind of just the first batch of what I came up with. But feel free to comment if you have any ideas. I really appreciate you guys watching. Hope you have a great night or day and I'll see you later.